uh, food <laughs> and bad words. <laughs> two <laughs> and two. <laughs> Hello, I'm Jaylin. You can call me Auntie Jaylin. Uh, my role in grandmother tongue, grandmother law. <laughs> I'm 58 this year. Up to the director lah. Maybe you want to increase the grandmother by one, two years older or what. But for now, it's 84 years old. It's very lucky to have a role that you can play like for three times. So I'm very grateful for that. Definitely because you have a chance to fine tune the characters. But also the challenge is like Wild Rice new space is uh, quite a uh, uh, hide up and all that. So hopefully not everyone see my white hair. <laughs> Definitely after two years for the, from the last run, I have gained some other experiences. Last year being the 200 years bicentennial. Some new thoughts about how we treat our traditions. So this part, uh, I think, will also uh, impact my playing as a grandmother, which only speak Teochew. Playing younger is, is challenging, lah, huh? but playing older is also very challenging because you, you need to have certain uh, core to hold your body at that gesture. On the outside, it's very relaxed, but in the inside, you actually hold that for quite some time. <laughs> So, so that, that, that uh, required training. My mother is my inspiration for, for molding this character. It's just like people in their era, they don't speak Mandarin or English, they only speak their dialect or some other's dialect. But for the Singapore, the English speaking Mandarin, Jiang Hua Yu. So they become just like the grandmother in the show. Her social life is like limited. But the more of their people who understand their language have gone, they even close it up themselves. Like now people uh, learn third language, Korean, <laughs> just like but our time is like all kind of dialect. If they can also pick up dialect, you know, as their third language, uh, since there are still people who speak the dialect still around, so maybe when the next time you want to learn a language, think about a dialect, <laughs> pick up a dialect. You will definitely feel sayang if it's lost. You, you start wanting to hear or to learn, then you will feel you want to reserve that. So hopefully the younger generation try to pick up some of this. <laughs>